This is the unboxing of the uh, new Seiko mod from Artifice Horror Works. You can see it comes in a nice little box. It's an unexpected little uh, presentation box. Here it is. So here is the Enhanced Seiko. It's a little warranty card from Alex. And there is the watch. That's it. great thing about these uh, modded Seikos is you get it exactly the way you want it. So this watch started life as a stock I'll Seiko the SKX 007. The rotating dive bezel was replaced with a smooth bezel. The dial was replaced with a Degas Expedition dial. The hands were replaced with Mercedes Rolex style hands with C3 illumination on them. The chapter ring was changed out for a black chapter ring. The original Seiko movement was removed and replaced with an NE36 hacking and hand winding movement. The crystal is a double dome sapphire crystal. It is a laser engraved case back and drilled lugs. This watch is a stunning piece. Alex at Artifice Horror Works was instrumental in making this watch come out the way it did. His experience in design and modeling watch features let us plan this out to the detail. This is a true one-off, one-of-kind modded Seiko. You can see it's on a NATO strap that Alex was kind enough to include with the watch. I had intended to change it out. However, I like it. It's comfortable and it fits the style of the watch perfectly. Looking at the laser engraved case back, you'll notice the detail. It has Alex's serial number and the original Seiko serial number. Alex built a jig that lets him drill lugs on Seiko SKXs. Mine was one of the first ones that he did. Looking at the loom, this is equivalent to a mixture of C1 and C3. It's very readable in the middle of the night. Alex hand painted the loom when he built the dial. So everything is hand applied. Well, this is your TexasWatchTalk.com watch review of the Artifice Horrorworks SKX Enhanced.